All right, thank you, Mike. This morning, abortions are no longer legal in the state of Tennessee for the first time in 50 years. The state's trigger law goes into effect today. It solidifies the Supreme Court's decision to overturn the 1973 legislation earlier this summer. We're going to walk through what this means. The state's trigger law bans doctors from giving abortion treatment to women in Tennessee, but it does allow doctors to perform abortions if a woman's life is at risk. Doctors would need to defend their decision in court. It's similar to a case of self-defense where the accused must prove they acted justly and within the law. Every time they choose to treat their patients, they accept the fact that they are committing a felony. The state legislature did pass the Human Life Protection Act back in 2019, which makes providing abortion treatments a felony in the state. But Tennessee Senator Richard Briggs says lawmakers plan to revisit the law in the next legislative session. Well, what the law really does, it serves as a placeholder uh, to have some sort of law in effect until we go back into session in uh, January of 2023. Women are still able to leave the state if they need abortion treatment. The Mountain Access Brigade offers several resources to help women in need. Another important note, the trigger law does not have exemptions for cases of rape or if a child is pregnant or for cases of incest. You can read more about the new law right now at WBIR.com.